Hey everyone, I'm Mola and today we are going to play Minecraft for Recipes and Stories. In this video I want to answer most popular questions about update 2019.7, so let's go! Okay, so this is actually my cafe with update 2019.7 and here I wanted to tell you a little bit more about it, maybe answer some of your questions and show you something that I haven't shown to you before. I will also reveal some answers to the riddles from Laura's story, so they will be at the end of this video because I don't want to spoil it to everyone. However, if you still need answers to them, then you can just watch the video till the end. First of all, I want to show you some unique items that you can get from Laura's story. And actually, here they are. This is the torch. I think everyone has it already. I really like it that it's so big and that it has real fire on it. And actually, it was given after the first order from Laura, so I think everyone has it already. Then we have that rock art. It's in classic style stone wall carving. It's a special decoration given to you by Margaret. And I also wanted to show you my cafe. It's in French style, mostly French champagne, with some elements of the opera style. Actually, I wanted to ask Fernando about the tips and he tells me that French style gives me 3014.48% tips. So I also wanted to check out how many tips the unique items can bring us. So let's for instance remove that stone art to the storage and then let's ask Fernando about it and he says that my tips have deteriorated by less than 1% actually. So these items make your cafe more beautiful but don't rely on them in terms of tips. They are not really big. So those are two items that you can get by the story for free and you can purchase the rest actually. Here are the cupcake tables. You can install up to 10 of them but even if you install one of them Petrovich is going to give you a gold gift for that. I'm not doing it right now because I'm waiting for the festival. Petrovich likes them because they remind him of his favorite TV series. And also, if I remove one of them, okay, sorry guys, I have to move you. Then we can ask Fernando about the tips and he says that our tips have decreased by two and a half percent, I guess. Actually, the tips grow much faster and bigger when we purchase the stylish equipment. Take, for instance, this one. I have purchased the stylish soda machine for three cups. If I remove it to the storage, then my tips were 314. And now my tips are actually 2914.45. Yeah, it's actually 100%, just the soda machine. This is why it costs such a big amount of gems. Check out the special offers. I hope that you have found something useful in the previous weekend when we when you were selling the equipment with 70% discount. However, we also have some nice discounts even now. They are 35% off. So you can save up your diamond and actually purchase and the stylish equipment is really a good investment. As for other purchases that can be given in the special offers, this is actually the Nile couch. It looks very beautiful. It is so bright and I think it will fit in a lot of interiors. If you want to get it as a bonus to a bunch of different gifts and bonuses, you can check this out. This is how it looks like. Actually, it doesn't bring a lot of tips either. So if I remove it, then Fernando will tell me that I have lost like two and a half percent tips as well. And the same concerns the Lear, but it's just very beautiful and just Take a look at that. It's so beautifully animated and it plays music. So if you want to have it, you should also check the special offers as well. That's the lady with the coffee. And Laura offers you to purchase it for 495 gems. And she actually says that it's going to be more expensive in the future. So what it can mean is that when this event is over and when we have the new update, you may be able to see it in the special offers, I think for gems or as a bonus to the real money purchases. And then it will cost more. Oh, here is our stuff. So I wanted to tell you more about their costumes. By the way, I've dressed them in the Roman costumes. And for that, I think Watson is going to give me a blue gift. So let's click on them. Let's change the appearance. And there is actually some new content in the costumes. Actually, we have added a lot of costumes from our previous updates. I wanted to tell you more about those Coffee Fast costumes, Sailor costume, 90s party and the Halloween costume. Actually, we used to sell them in our previous update. We used to sell them separately as separate parts of clothing. So if you have purchased them already, you can combine those costumes from different parts. So you don't really 
have to purchase them again, you will be able to customize your stuff, which is also really nice if you want it. Let's go back into the game and I also wanted to tell you more about the bunny maybe. There have been a lot of conversations last week about the new bunny, that it has several levels. Um, you were saying that it's really hard to get to the red gift. But actually what I wanted to say, we decided to combine the old bunny with one board with the new bunny which will have several boards. With the bunny that you are going to face on July 27, it's going to be Saturday, it's going to last from Saturday till Monday. We are going to test the version when the bunny will have yeah, the first board as an initial board as the old bunny has. It will have 150 cells and then the red gift will be waiting for you in the end. For those guys who want to play further, who want to get more gifts, more bonuses, the bunny will continue with the new level. So this is going to be a combination of the old bunny and the new bunny and you will be able to get even more prizes with that. Liam's orders, we have made more of them. They are going to help you pass the bunny without spending tickets. And for the new levels, we are going to have pink and blue orders. So you will be able to use cheaper prices to get to the new prizes. I really hope you are going to enjoy this combination and I'm willing to test it together with you. Also about the tickets, we have the special offer straight in the bunny game. And I really like it that while the bunny is up, you can buy tickets for the board game with a really nice discount. You can buy 10 tickets for 649 gems. This is much cheaper than in the bank. So don't miss it and especially combine it with the festival order to spend your gems. Some words about the cupcake for those of us who are at level 35. So I have gained the cupcake from Carl, the super cupcake from Carl when I was at level 34, but I did it just recently. So right now I need to upgrade it. So these are the recipes that you will be able to to do with the cupcake. So the first one is going to be with no stars. This is what you can do. Then for Dalmatian cupcake you will need one star. For South Night cupcake you will need two stars. And for Daisy super cupcake or it's chamomile super cupcake in the British version, you're going to upgrade it for three stars. All of the special offers with the super cupcake will be available to you straight away. You don't need to upgrade it. And also at level 34 I was given a special mirror. It's called Classic style vintage mirror. It's an unusual decoration. And also when I tap on it, there is a lady that shows up and the developer says that probably we are going to have more stories with that mirror in the future. So, so I think that we see that lady with the purpose. So we'll see what's going to be waiting for us in the future updates. Now I'm going to tell you some more things about the update and the spoilers. So if you want to finish the stories yourselves, then skip it and scroll till the end of the video. For those of you who want to know the secrets of the Laura archaeology story, I'm going to reveal them to you right now. Yeah, so the answer to the first comic, to count how many animals are here in the picture, there are actually seven of them. So this is the correct answer. The next question in the comics was pick the photo of the warrior. And actually you needed to choose the first warrior to continue. Also you needed to choose one of the seven wonders of the world to progress with the story. And actually it was Alexandria. This is a very nice comics after. As for the Margaret's offer to skip to the end of the story for 195 gems, she's going to offer it to you after you fulfill 22 orders. It will not move you by the roadmap of the orders because you will still need to complete 30 of them to get a gold gift. However, you can learn the end of the story straight away after the 22 orders. You will not need to wait and finish the story earlier. This is also how the crystal pyramid looks like. It brings me 153 gems per day till the end of the season. It doesn't actually matter if you decide to purchase it at the beginning of the season or at the end of it because the gems will still be accumulated and the full sum will be given to you by the end of the season. The only thing that you need to do is to earn trophies personally in festivals. So this is it guys. This is everything that I wanted to tell you about the newest update and I wish you good luck in developing your cafe. Thank you so much for playing with me. I hope everything has become clearer to you. If you like this video, please put a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and let's play together. Don't forget to click the bell to get all the news and tips about the game from my videos. Most of us already have the update, so please share your experience about how you play my cafe with 2019.7. I will be really glad to read your feedback. The authors of best comments are going to get pink gifts, so please leave your player ID together with the comment below this video. 
I will announce the winners by next Friday. So far, have fun in the game and see you next time. Bye bye. Thank you.